let's have a look how to quickly uh, design a few slides in PowerPoint 2010 and insert a video or a few video clips and images on in those slides and then um, add a certain transition between the slides okay so first to open a new slide when you open a PowerPoint click on new slide and again and again and again so we've got slides on the left hand side so the preview if you want to delete the slides just click on them and push delete on your keyboard so I'll have let's say four slides um, and in the first slide I'm going to insert the first video it's a good idea to save a PowerPoint in the folder where also other videos and pictures and other elements are sitting it's easy to transfer then the finished project around uh, from one computer to another computer so you go file save as on my desktop I have made a PowerPoint folder PowerPoint project and I'm going to call it let's say PowerPoint PowerPoint 1 and save and I'll show you that I already have in those uh, in that folder a few pictures so this is the folder this is the PowerPoint project which is empty just a few slides and these are the images and the videos that I'll be using and they, they're sitting on desktop so if I go file I'll start my computer my desktop you will find a folder which is called PowerPoint as I have just told you if I expand and navigate down to the folder here is where I have all the elements okay I'll minimize that so click on the first slide go from the home tab I click on insert tab on the right hand side video and then video from file and then go to the desktop where your folder is sitting PowerPoint project I'll select avatar insert so this is the original size of the video so if you, you can enlarge it if you want clicking in the corner and dragging uh, to the right or to the left up diagonally but if you make it much bigger you may lose the quality so I would keep the original size I'll just put it somewhere in the middle again then let's go to the next slide on the left click on that and go insert again video video from file wildlife insert this one is much bigger so we can just keep the size as it is don't worry about the boxes at the back they will not be visible when you play um, the presentation so if you go to the bottom right somewhere you've got slideshow click on that so if you go up or back this is the first slide when I click on the video it starts playing when you click on it it pauses when you click on the slide you go to the next slide which doesn't automatically start playing the video you have to click on it and the video starts playing so when you finish push escape on the keyboard to go out from the presentation and then you can adjust the size of the video clip as you want then we can also let's say let's go to the first slide you can uh, click on that video on the first slide and then on top on the video tools tab or tabs click on playback and select play automatically and click on the second slide click on the video and again playback on top right and instead of start playing on click select automatically that's it so if I go back uh, click on the first slide and preview in a slideshow you can see that he starts playing automatically when I go to the next slide the video starts playing automatically I push escape on my keyboard to go out um, to leave the presentation so that's it 
In the same way we can put pictures, embed, like insert a picture. I navigate to the same folder, PowerPoint project, put in the photograph, extend it across if you want, and the next slide again insert. Um, another way, faster way to insert a picture is drag and drop. Like I've got side by side, this is my PowerPoint presentation and this is my folder with the elements I'm playing, all the m multimedia bits. So I can just click on the penguins, picture and drag them across and that's it. Then you can just move around a little bit and uh, adjust the size. If you want to play again or preview the picture slides, click on the third slide with the pictures, slideshow and this is what it looks like. Uh, press the next button on the computer and it takes you to the next slide and then push escape to go out to leave the presentation and now we can also quickly have a look at what transition we can select uh, so that's the transition between the slides on top you will find a transitions tab click on that transition tab and then expand it a little bit and you will find different options you now fade and push and wipe so just play with that and see what it looks like for example I will try uncover so this is that transition and select apply to all all slides and um, you will go from slide to slide when you click on the mouse so apply to all and then click on preview or slideshow at the bottom when I push next the right arrow see the next slide again next again next and then escape to go out, or to leave outside the presentation, to leave the presentation, go back to your design, and uh, that's it. Uh, this is just the basic, well, how to's design simple PowerPoint presentation with embedded audio and video. We can, okay, since we're here, I can also quickly show you how, if you want, to insert narration in a slide, for example, slide number four. Uh, you can click on home oh, I'm sorry let me just think how to get back mm, insert and then audio record audio so this is your narration on top of that slide so it's the insert tab audio and record audio hopefully you have a decent headset um, ideally a USB headset but doesn't matter I'm just using a built-in microphone in my computer but um, it still does a job and click on record so the recording started once I put in time there were three penguins okay I didn't name the recorded um, audio as you can see I've got a little gray icon of speaker you can play on that to see the recording so the recording started once put a time there were three penguins okay so what we can do with this you can click on this audio recording and you've got format you've got different options here you can play with the actually icon or click on playback so you can say start automatically so when the slide opens the audio will start playing and you've got different options such as fade in, fade out, you can play with I'm not showing you now, you can also trim uh, trim audio right here but that's part of the next um, how to um, lesson um, what else can we do here, well that's it, you can play okay. and you can preview, click on that slide, click on preview so the recording started, once you put a time, and escape. So that's it. If you want to hide this icon, what we can do is 
format and we can send it backward which means it will not be visible preview the recording started once upon a time there were three penguins and escape and that's it